What's up everyone, Steve here. In this video today we're going to learn how to clone yourself, uh, how you can make a copy of yourself, a multi-copy. Uh, so let's get into the video. I'm going to show how you can do it. Just put it over there so you can see what I'm doing. Again, I'm going to use the same uh, remote, the one I used before in my other video. You can uh, click here, there's a link popping up, and you can see my other video that was about how you can make yourself fly in the air. I used the same remote to click my photo because my camera it doesn't have a Wi Fi, so I can't actually click my photos through my phone, so I have to use uh, this remote. First photo was about I was I will be sitting here and doing some work. Okay, let me just fix it. Up. Okay, the first photo will be about I'm sitting here and doing some work on my computer. And for the second shot, I just thought I can do it like uh, I'm vlogging about something. So I can just hold my this camera and like hold it in my hand and just try to act like I'm just recording myself. So let's shoot first photo. Let me put this camera here. That's probably you can see me. Okay, let me just clean up the area here. Okay. I'm using this more. I don't think it doesn't work. Take another one. Okay, now I'll just change my shirt. Now the other photo will be me vlogging on my camera, and for that I'll just change my uh, clothes. Not any clothes, just my shirt. Okay, all set. I'll just quickly change my shirt. Okay, here I'm back. I put a white shirt on. So for this, for this photo, I will be standing here somewhere, and I will take a, a photo from there, and I will be like vlogging myself. Okay, let's just act like a real vlogger, and I'm not a vlogger. That's fair. Okay. Once um, I will be like acting. I'm talking to someone. Another one. I'll take another photo. Be like here, I was. I'm just acting to say something. Another one, just in case. Okay, for the third photo, I will be uh, on my bed and I'm going to act that I'm using my phone. I'm doing some work, not work, I'm just chatting or using Instagram or something. Okay, I think it's set here. Where's my phone? Is my okay. Okay, for this one, I have to change my shirt again. So for the last photo, I'm going to wear this yellow shirt. So let me just grab my phone and a little more. I will be on my. I'll be like sitting like this, and then on my phone. And for Okay, for that photo, I'm just changing my idea. First, I was working on my computer. Now, I'm going to change that I'm just reading a paper or I'm just reading something like this. And where did the book go? Or it's in my pocket. So, I'm just going to use this paper and like I'm reading some paper. Or I'm just reading something else. Okay, let's try it. 
I'm gonna make an expression like, uh, what is that? If I get it. Okay, that's all I think uh, is good for making those kind of photos. Let's just go right into Lightroom and see what we got. Hmm. So, okay, here I'm back. Uh, I was not able to complete the video on that day so now I'm back I, uh, I already edited my photos but I didn't uh, Photoshop them I just put them in Lightroom and just give them a really quick edit so now I'm just gonna take those photo into Photoshop and gonna tell you how you can uh, it's not that hard you just like uh, cop uh, here you have a paper and you're just pasting like I'm standing here I, I will erase this whole part then I'm going to take another photo which have uh, me standing on this part but I will erase this part. So the bottom layer, the one I'm sitting or standing there, that will show up and it's going to look like there is a same background where there are two people standing over there. So it's really simple. Let's just go. I already made the thumbnail. So you can see here is the Photoshop. You can see... Uh, it looked really funny because I, I made a really weird face like I don't know I, I, that was a random thing I swear uh, I was just uh, testing the camera because it just have two second uh, or timer two second timer it doesn't have more than two seconds so I was like I was really quick and I really got like weird fit I have to take like 10 photos to get the the, the kind of photo I want so for so so this is the photo I'm gonna use and you can see uh, my hand is showing up there while I was clicking the background and this is the one that I said I would like I will be acting I'm vlogging right now and and this is the one while I was using my phone you can see my camera is over there the another one the one I right, right now I'm recording with and this is the one that I, uh, this is the one we change uh, when I said like I will be use I'll change it while I was working because it doesn't look that good so I changed it and these are the other ones so let's do it so I'll use this one for just drag it from here and put it on the background then command T then fit it on the frame I think I'll use this as my base photo. Let's try. I'll drag this one and put it on this photo. Command T. Fit it in there. Now create a layer. Then use the brush. And make sure you have your foreground color as black. Then just start painting. Just brush over. Hey, say hi. Abby. Hey, that's my brother, and he's making a YouTube channel. It's going to be. Uh, we didn't decide the name yet, but we're gonna make it. Don't worry. It's very near. But I have to say that. Okay. Okay. What are you doing here? Do you need something? No. Then why are you here? I would say hi. Hi. Take all of your time and just do it. I think I, I have another easy way to do it. I'm not. Okay, never mind. Maybe I can just use a quick selection tool. Maybe that can help me. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, that was a perfect selection. Now I can just go on the brush. Oh, I have to go on the selection and uh, click on select and inverse. So now I'll go on the brush and now just erase. Boom, that was really good. And it, it did a pretty good job. Let's see. Oh, uh, we, we can't go further than that. 
so this is the last photo the third one I'm going to do the same thing grab the brush and make sure your foreground color is back and just paint it okay so I'm just paint it out really quick I'm doing it as fast as I, as I can so I don't want to make the video really long so that's how you clone yourself for your photos that's my way that's how I will prefer you to do it it's not that hard it's not that hard work you just need to uh, put like uh, layers you can see I don't think so I use the background layer I can just delete it so you just need three photos your main photo will be like I use my main photo the one I was vlogging with and then I put the one photo where I was sitting or I was laying down on the bed and I was, I was using my phone and the third photo was the one me sitting on the chair and like acting like oh what's what is that on the paper so just stack all the layers and just make a mask and just erase the area you don't want for it and that's it that's how you can make that's how you can clone yourself and make yourself your twins I just change my t-shirt so I look more realistic or I can do a step further or I can just uh, uh, change the color of my turban I don't want to do it it's take time so that's it for this video if you like it hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more interesting videos I'll see you in my next one until then stay tuned and stay creative bye bye